Hi everyone. In this video, I am going to explain you about the kingdom plantae, the kingdom animalia, viruses, lichens, and mycorrhiza. Kingdom plantae. Kingdom plantae includes all eukaryotic, chlorophyll-containing organisms, commonly called plants. A few members are partially heterotrophic. such as insectivorous plants are parasites bladderwort nepenthes and venus flytrap are examples of insectivorous plants and cascuta rafflesia are parasitic plants the plant cells have an eukaryotic structure with prominent chloroplasts and cell wall mainly made up of cellulose plantae includes algae bryophytes pteridophytes gymnosperms and angiosperms mode of nutrition in plantae is polophytic which is absorption type of nutrition plant shows continuous and indefinite growth life cycle of plants has two distinct phases one is diploid sporophytic phase and the second one is the haploid gametophytic phase these two are alternative with each other the lengths of haploid and diploid phases and whether these phases are free living or dependent on others vary among different groups in plants this phenomena is called alternation of generation the kingdom animalia in this kingdom is characterized by heterotrophic eukaryotic organisms that are multicellular and their cells lack cell walls animalia they are directly or indirectly depends on plants for food animals digest their food in an internal cavity and store food resource has glycogen or fat mode of nutrition is holozoic by ingestion of food animalia follows a definite growth pattern and grows into adults that have a definite shape and size higher form shows elaborate sensory and neuromotor mechanism most of the animals are capable of locomotion the sexual reproduction is by copulation of male and female gametes followed by embryological development viruses viroids prions and lichens in the five kingdom classification of whittaker there is no mention of lichens and some acellular organisms like viruses viroids and prions viruses virus is a latin word which means poisonous fluid or venom or secretion according to pasteur according to louis pasteur virus means poisonous fluid or venom or secretion ivanovski separated a microorganism from sap of infected plant and named tmv he reported that viruses are smaller than bacteria and they can pass through bacterial proof filters Benjerink demonstrated that the extract of infected plants of tobacco could cause infection in healthy plants called the fluid as contagium vivum fluidum infectious living fluid Stanley is the scientist first crystallized the virus TMV tobacco mosaic virus characteristic features of viruses viruses are submicroscopic and non cellular organisms but 
viruses are obligate intracellular parasites viruses have either rna or dna but no virus contains both dna and rna viruses are inert outside those are like just chemicals in outside environment viruses contain nucleic acid so they are capable of protein synthesis by the help of ribosomes of host cell size of viruses less than 200 nanometers but the size of tmv is 300 micrometers into 20 micrometers or 200 micrometers into 20 micrometer shape influenza virus and the hiv are spherical in size tmv virus is rod shaped bacteria phages are tadpole shape nucleic acid either rna or dna most of the plant viruses contains single stranded rna but in cauliflower mosaic virus double stranded dna and gemini are curly top viruses having single stranded dna most of the animal viruses contains double stranded dna but some animal viruses contains single stranded or double stranded rna protein coat protein coat of virus known as capsid and it is made up of small subunits called capsomeres helical symmetry capsomeres arranged in helical manner example tmv and mumps virus icosahedral symmetry it is a special type of symmetry seen in polyhedral viruses example herpes virus adenovirus f into 174 bacteriophage important viruses very first one tmv tobacco mosaic virus tmv is the most thoroughly studied virus and was discovered by a russian worker d ivanovsky in the year 1892 tmv shows helical symmetry tmv has single stranded rna in its capsid number of capsomeres are 2130 TMV composed with 5% of RNA and 95% of protein composed with capsomeres. The second one, bacteriophages. The virus which infects bacteria called bacteriophages. Bacteriophages first discovered by F. W. Twart and named by Felix D. Herrelli. Bacteriophages are generally double stranded dna viruses in qb bacteriophage ssrna is present in pi 174 bacteriophage they contains ssdna which means single stranded dna let's check the diagrammatic representation of bacteriophage how they contains head collar sheath tail pins and tail fibers cyanophages the viruses which infects blue green algae called cyanophages the viruses which infects fungi called mycophages the viruses which infects algae called phycophages viroids discovered by the scientist to dynir viroids are smaller than viruses Viroids contains single stranded RNA and not the protein coat. Example potato spindle tuber disease. Prions discovered by Prusenir. It is smallest proteinaceous infectious agent. Prions are similar to viruses. Example mad cow disease in cattle. It is analogous to CR Jacob disease. which is also called cjd crutchfield jacob disease in human beings
Prions also causes crew laughing death disease in humans and scrappy disease in sheep. Lichens. The term lichen was given by the scientist Theophrastus. Study of lichens is called lichenology. Algal component of lichen synthesizes carbohydrates by photosynthesis and provides nutrition to fungal component. And fungal component provides shelter and absorbs mineral nutrients and water for algae. Lichen is best example of symbiosis. Lichens having two components like algal component is called phycobiont, fungal component is called mycobiont. Lichens are very good pollution indicators and sensitive to SO2 and uh, die at higher levels of SO2. So lichens are found in industrial areas where atmosphere is polluted by smoke, especially SO2. Examples, crustose lichen closely adhered to the rocky substratum, example graphis. Foliage lichen attached to the substratum with the help of Rhizoid like rhizines, example, permelia. Fruticose lichens attached to substratum by basal mucilaginous disc, example, cladonia usnia. Mycorrhiza. The symbiotic association between roots of vascular plants and fungus called mycorrhiza. Fungus obtain food and shelter from root and it helps to root in absorption of water and minerals. Mycorrhiza name was given by the scientist Frank. Mycorrhiza classified into two types, ectomycorrhiza, endomycorrhiza. Very first one, ectomycorrhiza or ectotrophic mycorrhiza which occurs 3% of species. In this type of mycorrhiza, fungi present on surface of a root and completely covered by pseudoparenchymatia seed. Plants example, pinus, fagus, abyss, oak, eucalyptus, etc. Fungi examples, clavetia, amanita, Hebiloma, Laxaria, Pisolithus, etc. Note, Amanita is found in pinus roots. Endomycorrhiza or endotropic mycorrhiza. In this type, fungal hyphae enter intracellularly in cortex of root. Intracellular fungal hyphae form knob-like structures called arbuscules. So, endomycorrhiza is called vesicular or vascular mycorrhiza, which is called VAM, vesicular or vascular mycorrhiza. VAM helps in phosphate absorption. Fungi examples, glomus, cartesium, rhizoctonia. Plant examples, orchid plants. Orchid plants are obligately dependent on mycorrhiza for their seed germination and development. Up to here, the chapter biological classification was completed. In next video, I will start new chapter. Thank you very much.